Hi all, and welcome back to our Skyrim Let's Play Path of the Vampire. I'm oh, sorry, Path of the Werewolf. <laughs> uh, yeah, um, for a time now we have been trying to find a mate uh, for uh, uh, myself, Whiskers here, and uh, so yeah, so we can... Uh... <coughs> What's wrong? Maisha? Oh well. So yeah, um, Sharana, would you please? Yeah, you might already have seen it there, uh, what she said. <laughs> yeah, I got a little bit of a surprise for you. I'm no longer female. Nope. I've had a sex change operation. What do you <laughs> Nah, I've just, uh, um, done with the code here. And then typed in, uh, show. Oops, no, that's it. Typed in that. Of course, uh, when you do remember to have your character completely stripped of all items you may carry on him, well, the game will crash. But yeah, and change it to male because I'm a bit conflicted with having a female character trying to find a male mate because I'm not the one for giving it, I'm the one for receiving it. But yeah, um,. <laughs> now I'm uh, now I'm a bit more comfortable with going out and finding a female uh, mate for me to marry and stuff like that. Oh my God, death hounds are used uh, as guardians of by vampires. Yeah, we know that already. And here we are. We got Rudolph and we got Nightmare over there. How you doing, Rudolph? With your shiny nose. And of course, Nightmare, my favorite. Oh, you're so beautiful with your big red eyes. Yeah, you're so beautiful. I'm sorry, Rudolph, but Nightmare will always be my favorite. But uh, in a pinch, where there's no place for normal horses to go, of course I'll be calling on you. Um, yeah, nice to run. Uh, now with a little bit more... Um, flexibility let's go and have a look because the, I have a quest to deliver uh, just the people deliver there we go that one because the one I'm supposed to deliver this to if I'm not mistaken is apparently quite beautiful uh, living up grants a bonus to your choice of health, magic, and stamina. Choosing stamina also increases your carrying capacity. We already know that. Yeah, uh, yeah, I was wrong. Annika used to help more with the mining, but nowadays she's a bit of a bounder. Bounder? It's a shame our daughter could make the journey herself. But at least she still thinks of uh -oh. us. If you wouldn't mind bringing this back to her for us, I'd appreciate it. Okay. All right then. Dragon. Uh, oh yeah. Sorry, that is the wrong one. We don't have it, do we? Here? No, we don't. Someone do something. Yeah, I'm on. I'm on it. Uh, that one. Thank you. And unwilling force. Yeah. <laughs> What are you doing over there, dragon? Ooh, I gotcha. Oh, you want to play rough, do you? Get 
Get on down here, you stupid son of a bitch. Elder Dragon, no less. Hmm. Ah, well, the dog I call. Flawless Ruby, nice. From Dragon Bone and that. Thank you. What about the Raptor? I got. Whoop. You got my lap. Okay, we cannot have you lying right there, so Serana, would you please join me up here? Thank you. Okay, can't move you. Okay, I am now supposed to deliver... Yeah, go over here. I think this is the place where you can find or find, make or buy a variety of gifts for your children. Yeah, I know. But well, my children are quite special. They don't accept just anything. Here we go. This is the one I'm talking about. I trust my parents are well. Ah, uh, yes. Seems he sent back my satchel stuffed with letters. I look forward to reading them. I appreciate the delivery. Here, I want you to have this. I insist. Silver Emerald Necklace added. Are you interested in me, are you? <laughs> well, yes. Why wouldn't I be? Are you interested in me? Hmm. No, I'm not. <laughs> Well, do you know what? She's kind of uh, kind of pretty to look at, so yeah. Do you know what? Life it's is short. Settled, then. Brief as life can be in Skyrim, at least we'll have each other. Yeah. Now I'm gonna go to Riften and make for preparation. Ooh, Riften ore. Thank you. I'll take that. Hey, uh, Rudolph, where are you, you uh, big, beautiful beast? We are needing to go to Riften. Gain some altitude. Um, a spider down there apparently wants to hurt me. That feel. Okay, yeah, that's exactly the way we need to go. Off to Riften. Hey, is that a werewolf? That it is. That is a werewolf. Ah, screen. Uh, Rudolph? Where did Rudolph go? Oh, there he is. Uh, Rudolph? Um. Ah, okay, I could just go up to you. Okay, cool. Yeah, this is one of the things I'm talking about.
Yeah. Apparently this is a place we need to go before we can go to Riften. Okay, cool. And with that, we're just gonna go over here and make a control descent. Yoink! Whammo! Serana, what have I told you? Never have fun without me. Who's there? I knew I heard something. <sighs> okay, let's see here. Let's just steal a couple of things before he can complete control. There we go. Let's go over and have some fun. I'll mount your head on my wall! <laughs> Ah, god damn it! What the fuck? Oh my god. Huh? That red light down there, is that Rudolph? I think that is Rudolph. So, yeah, we had a little crash. Uh, apparently, uh, the game didn't like me shooting at the... Uh, yeah, that's Rudolph. I don't. Okay, so yeah, now we are needing to go to Shores and we're gonna talk to her again. Uh, inns are great places to pick up rumors. The innkeeper usually points you to local quests. Oh, cool. Yeah, we already know that. What the Dramosphere lacks in strength, it makes up for in speed and mobility, as it patrols the halls of the Drama Ruins in still protect. Yeah, we know that. Hey, how you doing? And here we go. Let's uh, propose one more time. To this lovely young lady. I trust here. my parents are well. Yes. Ah, uh, yes. Seems he sent back my satchel stuffed with letters. I look forward to reading them. I appreciate the delivery. Here, I want you to have this. I insist. And, uh, interested in me, are you? Oh, yes. Why wouldn't I be? Are you interested in me? Uh, yes, I am. It's settled, then. Brief as life can be in Skyrim, at least we'll have each other. Okay. And now let's just, uh, hey, how you doing there, you big fatty moose? Instead of flying over to Riften, we're going to fast travel so we can, so Fort Greenwall there can. Uh, we're going to go to Mr. Keep Thieves Guild. We're going to go to Mr. Keep. That way we are inside the city already. So we don't have to go up to the, po uh, the front gates and... <sighs> yeah, we know that all. Huh? Who threw swords at me? I heard someone do... Stay alive. Why take a chance? I'm no fan of the sun. That would be better than this. I heard someone... Who the heck is this idiot up here? Harold? Who the heck is Harold? Out of my way! The son of the Jarl has no time for idle conversation with travelers. Only a dagger for the son of the Jarl? If you must know, I was practicing in the yard when the guard I was sparring with fainted when I specifically told him to duck. My blade bit right into the stonework next to the keep and needed serious repairs. Thankfully, our smith, Balamond, works wonders. In fact, if you'd fetch my blade from him, I'd be most appreciative. I'll get it for you. Thank you. Do hurry, please.
Every day the threat of what are you doing, from Serana? Rifton draws closer for myself and my family. Who knows how many spies the Empire has sent into our midst already? We're at war. This isn't the time for hospitality. Thank goodness Mother is keeping a level head about everything. If my brother Sailand had his way, we'd be flying Imperial colors by now. Can you believe that fool had the audacity to speak of his love for the Empire in the plaza? He expects us to drop our defenses and greet them with open arms. To dialogue with them rather than defend our homeland by spilling their blood. He's a traitor, plain and simple. Had I been sitting on the throne, he'd be hanging from the gallows for his sympathies toward the Empire. Damn. Now, if you'll excuse me. Okay, son of the yard. Oh, damn. That was that was was new. I've never seen him before. Okay. Um. Where is the smith anyway? Who's this? Visiting Riften. Oh, pleased to meet you. I'm a priestess at the Temple of Mara. Did you get Mara. that purchase agreement to Markarth yet? New in town, eh? Here for the fishing, I guess. Remember to give at the temple. This must be that beautiful Skyrim weather I've always heard about. Yep. Um, okay, that was a bit weird. If you're looking for a handout, you'll want to speak with my husband. If you're looking for company, I suppose I could do worse. Okay, damn. Total prostitute. <laughs> when I'm not into that, we are going to go up here and make an appointment to get married. Yo, dude! How may I help you, my son? I'd like to have a wedding at the temple. You wish to be married? It's good to see love blossoming even during these difficult times. Your wedding will be held tomorrow, from dawn until dusk. Don't be late. You don't want to miss your own wedding. Okay. May you return to her benevolence and safety. Attend your wedding. Okay. Um, what time is it at the present time? It is... 1.50 p.m. So that's quite a lot of hours. So ah, I can see it up there. Sorry about that. <laughs> so tomorrow from dawn until dusk. Okay, cool. Dawn, that is about 6 a.m. I think. So yeah, we got we got some time. Oh, sorry about that. Okay, let's see here. Okay. What can we locate? The, oh yeah, that's right. Locate the grave of the Ark. Yeah, we can do this one. Let's see what the heck this is all about. This one, then this one, and then the last one, the ritual site. Okay, let's do this one. Uh, it is all the way up here. That's going to take us some time. Call the window hold. Let's fast travel to here. Let's hope that. Let's hope that we are not too late. Attend your wedding ceremony. Oh fucking hell! We were too late. Ah fucking hell! Okay, uh, we're gonna do this instead. Yeah. That was a bit too far away. And if I were to fast travel back, I would have missed my own waiting, so we're not gonna do that. Um time is so fleeting in Skyrim. There we go. You know what? We're just gonna go back in and we're gonna wait. What did it say the time was four something uh, a.m. in the morning or something like that? Yeah. So we are gonna wait here. 
Let's have a sit. Congratulations on your wedding. I'm so happy for the both of you. Uh, we haven't had it yet. The adult. Okay. Let's wait. Yeah, 2.50 p.m. It says 20, uh, 14.06. That's, that's the way I... Or we read it here in Denmark, so yeah. So let's wait. Uh, two, that's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, uh, twelve, one a.m., two a.m., three a.m. Yeah. My calculations are correct. Here we go. Congratulations on your wedding. Why is he I'm naked? So happy for the both of you. Why is he naked? Ah, here's the proud groom now. Let's begin the ceremony. Congratulations on your wedding. First gave birth uh, so to happy all for the both of you and pledged to watch over us as her children. It is from her love of us that we first learned to love one another. It is from this love that we learned that a life lived alone is no life at all. Damn. We gather here today under Mara's loving gaze to bear witness to the union of two souls in eternal companionship. May they journey forth together in this life. Why is he in naked? Next, in prosperity and poverty, and in joy and hardship. Do you agree to be bound together in love, now and forever? I do, <clears throat> now and forever. Do you agree to be bound together in love, now and forever? Under the authority of Mara, the divine of love, I declare this couple to be wed. I present the two of you with these matching rings, and she's just blessed gone. by Mara's divine grace. May they protect each of you in your new life together. Congratulations on your wedding. I'm so happy for both of you. Congratulations on Where the heck did she go? Damn. The wedding wasn't even over and she just bolted off. May the gods watch over your battles, friend. Where the heck did she go? And getting out of here. Someone do something. Huh? A fight. God, I am staying out of this. This should be good. We're married. I guess we'll need to decide where we're living, won't we? You can always stay with me. Oh, but you have children, don't you? We'll have to find somewhere with room for them. How about my house in Falkreath? Our new home. I'll see you there. That was not the text that's... Oh, uh -huh, well. An Orcus war axe. Yeah, I'm thinking of also getting uh, the mod that calls Ultimate Follower. Dragons breathing fire in the sky. Vampires brazenly attacking people on the street. It's the end of the world, I tell you. No, not just yet. Uh, where we are to? Even? Ah, yeah. Locate that one. But we're not going to do that just yet. We're gonna go home and see if we can't meet her there. <clears throat> I also need to finish up the house. I've uh, done a little bit of reading, and uh, why I don't, uh, why I can't get a yarl or a point, uh, uh, a point, uh, Sarana here, steward of. Uh, our lovely home is because the house isn't completely 100% done. 
Yeah. Whoa. Papa, you're home. Did you bring me anything? Let's see. I can't say not this time. No, it's wow, here. really? What do you get me? What can I give her? I can't give her anything. Oh, stop teasing me. <laughs> Papa. So apparently Mama hasn't returned just yet. Or has she? Is she just somewhere? Why is the first thing I look at is in the kitchen? <laughs> My god, what a stereotypical idiot. Ah, uh, yeah, well. Let me just have to give her a little bit of time. Hey, Pa. Oh, yeah, almost forgot. See it. <laughs> Look. Maybe we should take this one and place it right there. Yeah, let's just give her some time to. Whoa! Why is this bull not up here? There we go. Going around. Yeah. I don't know if I showed you this, but I. Managed to place a jukebox right in there, that's pretty cool. Any more bowls? It needs placing. Did you really build this house all by yourself? Wow! Yes, I did. Yeah, two dresses that I won't be using anytime yes. soon. Mm, yeah, what I mean is 100% done is these work benches right here. Oh, hey, cool. Uh, these has to be taken out of the house before it is 100% done. But I want to... I want to finish up the rest of it. So got some walls got us here. Alright, it's over here. We only got two for this one. And in here we still got a lot of items we need. See barrels, containers, furnishings, shelves, exterior that's up on top. And these, yeah. So, uh, yeah. Do you know what? I have an idea. Magically improve this house in a second. From this. And so we are back. <sighs> this took a little bit longer than expected, actually. <laughs> oh my god, finding all the materials and stuff but yeah we got some cool trophies on the wall also this big guy right here in the middle oh damn so yeah and the kitchen has come uh, not much but yeah does look uh, all that different. And in the bedrooms, a couple of heads have come up on the wall. Hey, how you doing? And yeah, apparently uh, Raja likes to uh, go down with this new present I gave him. But yeah, in here there's that one, and yeah, that's about it. But here, damn, you remember before how desolate and barren it was 
now there is room for just about everything. And uh, upstairs, got yourself a fancy saber cat tiger head right there. A couple of wolf heads right here. And outside here, behind, we should have got a few things set up. Whoa, yeah. Table and basin and yeah, cool stuff. But we have a little bit of a problem. Well, I do. The woman I married seems like she doesn't want to get over here. Like she continues to stay where she is. If anyone has any idea as to why she doesn't want to uh, come over here, please don't hesitate to leave it in the comments below. How are you doing, Serena? Huh? Ah, yeah. Papa! Hey. How are you doing? There we have Raja. Hey, Pa! Or oh, Maraca. Maraca. I just got a phone. Raja, <laughs> his uh, pet name, yeah, and down here we have gotten all of the uh, statues, and my favorite, the statue of Talos, and in here we've gotten some safes set up, but yeah, I'm thinking that uh, they are going to improve it because why would they make this if there weren't supposed to be some kind of another room in, in here or something like that. I hope that uh, they are making a another room for the uh, yeah uh, hot fire DLC. That could be cool. So yeah, uh, the house is completely finished. I have removed all of the um, uh, the workbenches, as you can see. And yet still, I feel like there's something missing, something not quite done. Because as you can see here, this workbench over here, the carpenter's table, the chest, and a drafting table are still here and I can still uh, I can still place them inside as you can see the uh, uh, bedroom remove work is a way I can place them back in but yeah feels like something is wrong Rudolph what are you doing are you smelling his butt what the fuck but yeah also I'm going to take out all of what's in here Put it in bookshelves and stuff like that, and yeah, just clean this chest out. As you can see, there is a ton of stuff in here. Armors and weapons, yeah, just going into my storage room and just placing them in their respective places. For example, weapons, oh my god. Weird looking ones. Daedric Bow of Stormage, yeah. Ebony Blade. The Falma Ghost Blade. Glass blades. Oh yeah, the two daggers here. Pretty cool. Oh yeah. 
Nordic blade, machete, mace of Moloch ball, man, all the weird weapons I've got in here. Let's spider control staff. Save here, then go on to wardrobes and hoods. I have a mind just to take everything, just loot all, go in and see if I can't uh, uh, decent chance have of it. Oh, yeah, crossies. Yeah, also the mask. I've got the masks. Yeah. But, uh, yeah. If you guys could tell me why the fuck my wife doesn't want to go and live with me here, that would be awesome. And, yeah. Um, thank you all so very much for watching. I catch you on the flip side.